Oh, so we've had a lot of people getting in touch looking for some recommendations on some classic box sets. Now, there's a lot of really good stuff out there at the moment. You've got Breaking Bad, House of Cards, Narcos is back on Netflix, and of course, Game of Thrones. Who's not watching Game of Thrones? My own personal favourite, my own recommendation, though, is all the way from 1988. It's the spectacular Australian drama, Home and Away. Now, where do I start with this? It's set in a beachside town called Summer Bay. They call it a drama, but it's so much more than that. Let's just have a look at some of the central characters that are currently in the show to give you a bit of an idea of the themes running through it. Alex Stewart, main character in it since 1988, since the very, very start. Now, Alex had multiple amazing storylines over the years. He's lost his memory and got it back more times than I can think of. But recently, a lot of health issues. Heart attack, nearly drowned rescued off a boat and he had a stroke as well recently. Now, it was looking like they were going to try and kill him off. I don't think they're going to do that. He's pulling through, he's looking good. I think we're going to be okay with Al for a while more yet. Now, Josh and Andy, the rebel brothers. Complicated one this now. Josh killed Sharrett. He pretended he was blind, so he got away with it. Ultimately, got caught, but then Andy took the blame for it. Meanwhile, they didn't find out that it was Josh that did it. So Josh is about to go to jail, but then Andy arranges for them to run away from home and away. I don't even see them again, to be honest. Now Irene, character who's been in the show for quite some time, alcoholic on and off, some recent dramatic storylines, she was kidnapped for a long period of time. It turns out it was her son that actually kidnapped her. Bit of a weird one, strong character for everybody else in the bay when she's not drinking. Now Dr. Nate, lover boy. He's either flirted or gone out with or even married most of the women in the bay at this stage. He's a bit of a pain, but he's a damn good doctor. And then you've got Kat. Now Kat is the local guard. She's been in the show for a couple of years now. Good storylines, but she does spend a lot of time arresting her ex-boyfriends. Originally from Chile, but she's making a good living for herself now down in Summer Bay. And finally, we did get an email in from Sean in Castlebar, County Mayo. He asked us about Tom and Pippa, classic characters from the beginning of the show. Bit of bad news there now, Sean. Unfortunately, Tom was actually killed off. He was killed in a car accident in 1991. Without warning, a tragedy beyond comprehension. Ah, oh, there's just no justice, Ailes. How much more is this family going to have to go through? That's really it, folks. Gives you a bit of an insight into the show. It's quality stuff. Give it a go. It's not on Netflix now, but I think you will get it on the RTE player. So see what you think and enjoy it.